better to be hated for who you are than loved for who you are. Seventeen-year-old Brittany Cade dreams of being a model, but from an early age she struggled with her body and her identity. I think I first realized that I was born in the wrong body when I was three or four years old, when I would play with normal toys that girls would, and not normal boy toys. I was suppressing all my feelings of just wanting to be myself. Brittany was born a male named Brandon. I started to notice that Brittany was identifying as a female probably around 18 months, too, when the child started walking. She wanted to wear my high heels. She wanted to dress up and play with the girl toys. I noticed really young. You know, she was just a depressed, kind of sad child. And it really worried me. It really concerned me. Brittany's struggles were made harder by bullies who left her too terrified to return to school. Peers were not very nice to me at school. I've been punched in my stomach. I've been trampled by other kids at school. I've had my hair pulled. I've been pushed, shoved. Yeah. It was just very hard for me and I was miserable and I needed to take a step back and find out who I was. But since being homeschooled and starting her transition, her whole life has been transformed. I started taking hormones when I was 15. Emotionally, I was very happy. I had finally found out what I was and I was able to do what I always wanted to. I was probably the most happy I've ever been. I'm happy. I think that's all that matters. I love myself. I've not had any cosmetic surgery. I don't know if I plan on having gender reassignment surgery as of now. That's still a big question and I will continue to think about that in the future. Brittany has always had the support of her mother and stepfather. Brittany has changed a lot mentally during her transition. She's brightened up. It's like watching a flower bloom. I've seen to become a woman. It seems so natural. It's hard for me to look back and see Brennan. I love her very much. I'm very proud of her. She's one of the bravest people I know. And she has their full backing in her dreams of becoming a model. The way I feel about my body today is a whole different change. I'm a lot more confident and I think that shows on the outside too. Brittany's newfound confidence is extending to all areas of her life. I just broke up with guy that I had been with for two years, so I'm single right now. I don't think it's that important to be in a relationship. As long as you are okay with yourself and accept yourself, then that's all that matters. You don't really need anyone else in your life, except for some close family members and friends. I guess something that I would like to say or any advice I'd give to other people that have been in my situation in the past is never give up. You're never alone. There's always a light at the end of the tunnel.